Today we're learning about consecutive integers. First, we're learning about regular consecutive integers, odd consecutive integers, and even consecutive integers. Okay. What is a consecutive integer? A consecutive integers are integers that follow one another in order. They start by any integer and count by one. Here's an example. Go. One, two, three, four. What is a consecutive odd integer? A consecutive odd integers are numbers that follow one another in order and start by any odd integers, but they go by odd numbers. Here's an example. One, three, five, seven. A consecutive even integer are even integers that follow one another in order and start with an even number. So here's an example. Two, four, Six, For our first problem, we're going to do a consecutive integer problem. We have to find two numbers whose sum is equal up to 25. The first thing we have to do is make our let x statements. Our first let x statement is going to be x equal first consecutive integer. Our second let x statement is going to be x plus 1 equals second consecutive integer. Then we have to combine these together. We get x plus x plus 1 equals 25. Now we have to combine the like terms, the two x's. So we're going to get 2x plus 1 equals 25. Then we're going to subtract 1 from each side, minus 1, minus 1. And we're going to get 2x equals 24. And then we have to divide by 2. So we're going to get x equals 12. Now we have to replace the x's with the 12. So our first number is going to be 12 and our second one is going to be replaced with the 12 and we're going to get 12 plus 1 equals 13. Now to check these we have to combine both of them. So we're going to add the 13 plus the 12 and we're going to get 25. For our next problem, we want to find three consecutive odd numbers whose sum is equal up to 25. First, we have to write out our let x statements. Our first let x statement is going to be let x equal first consecutive odd integer, let x plus 2 equal second consecutive odd integer, let x plus 3 equal third consecutive odd integer, and then we have to combine all of these together. So we're going to get x plus x plus 2 plus x plus 4 equals 27. Now we want to combine the like terms. So we're going to get 3x plus 6 equals 27. Then we have to subtract 6 from each side. So we're going to get 3x equals 21. Then we have to divide by 3 from each side. We're going to get x equals 7. And then we have to replace the, all the x's with the 7. So our first consecutive odd number is going to be 7. Our second consecutive odd number is going to be 7 plus 2, which is 9. And our third consecutive odd number is going to be 7 plus 4, which is 11. I'm going to add these to check them, and we're going to get 27. Next, we're going to do a consecutive even integer problem. We want to find three consecutive even integers whose sum is equal up to 24. So the first thing we have to do is make our let x statements. Our first let x statement is let x equal first consecutive even integer. Our second let x statement is let x plus 2 equal second consecutive even integer. And our third let x statement is let x plus 4 equals third consecutive even integer. Now we want to combine all of these together. We're going to get x plus x plus 2 plus x plus 4 equals 24. The next step is to combine our like terms. 
get 3x plus 6 equals 24. Then we're going to subtract 6 from each side and get 3x equals 18. Then we want to divide by 3 on each side and we're going to get x equals 6. Then we're going to replace all the x's with the 6. So it's the first consecutive even integer is going to be 6. The second one is going to be 8. And the third one is going to be 10. To check these, we add them all together and we're going to get 24. Bye. Have a nice day.